what's going on everybody hope all y'all having an amazing day so i asked y'all on a poll the other day what kind of videos y'all want to see more of whether it be moto vlogs or pure sound rides and uh i think like 74 or like 75 percent of y'all voted for regular moto vlogs so that's what we're doing today so i got the discord server up and running by the way i'm gonna put the uh, invite link to that in the description of this video as well as a bunch of other videos and also made a community post about that one too so if y'all want to find that just go look at at uh, the community post or check the description everybody's welcome it's just gonna be a nice little place to hang out y'all can talk to me a little bit more i'll be able to respond to messages a lot better than i can like on on youtube or instagram y'all will be notified like a few days early when a new video is going to be coming out and also there's a section in there where y'all can kind of give me ideas about new youtube videos and if i use your idea in a video then i'll give you all a shout out so definitely go join that should be pretty fun sorry it was so late by the way i started making it um i can't remember which video it was that i talked about it but i started making it then and i just got so busy i just didn't really ever finish it The R7 is running great, looking great. The exhaust is sounding amazing. I installed a new tail light last night. I'll throw a picture up of that if I remember. Looks pretty good, what anything crazy. Uh, for anybody wondering if you have an R7 and you want to change out that tail light, uh, the R6 and the R7 tail light are the exact same. So any aftermarket tail light made for the R6 will fit on the R7. So if you find one you like, go ahead and buy it, it'll work. I need to make a little bit of an announcement real quick so this does not apply to everybody who has been asking me this question because some of you will come on just ask once and leave it at that but i've had a couple people who will basically just spam my comments asking for a top speed video as well as gotten to the point where they're now dming me on instagram and everything asking the same question so i'm gonna go ahead and say this in a video so i don't have to keep responding Guys, I'm not doing a top speed video on this bike anytime soon. I'm sure a couple people are gonna unsubscribe and all that, which is cool, whatever. But guys, look, I don't get paid by YouTube, okay? I do this for fun. I'm not gonna risk going to jail or dying or losing my motorcycles because I can't afford the insurance anymore over a YouTube video. I'll go fast sometimes, I'll have some fun, but there's nowhere around here that I can safely go to the top speed of this bike. So I'm just not gonna do it, I'm sorry. And again, like I said, I know some people are gonna get mad at that, and unsubscribe but for those of you who have stuck around for a while on this channel you guys might remember like the first actual moto vlog that i made where i talked about why i started this channel for some of you new people i'm gonna kind of go back over that real quick so i started a moto vlog channel because first of all moto vlogs were the thing that got me into motorcycles in the first place if it wasn't for watching moto vlogs on youtube and stuff i probably wouldn't even own a motorcycle today so guys the other reason i do it is I want to be a positive influence on people you know we live in kind of a crazy world where there's a lot of negativity one of the main reasons why i want to start youtube was because i kind of felt that if i could make a video that helps someone just kind of escape the real world for 10 minutes a day then that's great and again i don't care if i have a hundred subscribers or a hundred thousand subscribers as long as i am making a positive impact on someone's life someone's day even that's all that matters to me i don't care about the numbers but on a different topic um i am probably going to do a full review of the r7 probably within the next i want to say two or three weeks don't quote me on that but that's kind of the the goal right now i think i've got enough experience with it i've written enough and i know enough about it to where i can actually do a true review on this bike so again, i don't have an exact time or day for that but i uh, just know it will be coming in the near future now i know i did just get done talking about how i don't care about numbers and all that but i do want to thank you guys for over a thousand subscribers we hit it like a week ago i kept meaning to put it in videos but as i was recording i kept forgetting so here we are now thank you guys so much for a thousand subscribers it means a lot to me to know that that many people are actually watching my content so again thank you guys so much for that i'm just glad i finally got a nice day to ride it has been raining like on and off this whole week i hate summer in georgia it is so bad it's like the weather just never gets it right but luckily today we've got a nice little uh sunny patch but of course it looks like it's about to rain so I'm probably about to head home and uh, 
do some yard work before it starts pouring on me even though that probably feel really good because it's also like 95 degrees outside and one last thing before we go i may start doing dual moto vlogs with uh a good buddy of mine he just got a bike like a month and a half ago and uh we've been riding together a lot recently he just doesn't have a gopro or anything so i'm probably gonna help him out with that get him a setup going and uh get some good content so if y'all want to see that let me know in the comments and i will try to set that up but either way that's gonna do it for this video i hope you guys enjoyed it ride safe and i will see y'all on the next one